Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Tools. In today's video, I have something different. It's not a haul or a DIY. So, this, this I have been seeing on Facebook and YouTube, on my YouTube feed and on my Facebook feed. Um, it's the new Momo Challenge. As you can see, there have, there's have been lots of different challenges as the Slender Man or kids sitting in the detergent pots or the Black Mirror or the Shut Up and Dance and the blue whale challenge okay this challenge it's targets like young children and encourage them to text a number on whatsapp app which then sends them instructions to complete a series of increasingly bizarre and dangerous tasks from watching a horror movie to engaging in self-harm to take in their own lives. Yes. This new challenge about the Momo is something that the parents are now freaking out. But if you're a parent, you need to be aware of what your kids are watching on YouTube and always, always be on track while they watch and give them like an hour or a half an hour time period on having their tablets on. Me as a parent, I have three kids. I usually never let them watch YouTube kids on the tablet when they use the tablet. I always have like a lock to monitor where they're going and what are they watching. So if you're a parent, you need to be aware of what your kids are watching. Um, this is the new challenge and it, it's very creepy. Um, I blurred her face out because my kids sometimes see my YouTube videos and I really don't want them to freak out when they see the thumbnail. It is um, a character, oh, well, it's not a character, it's a sculpture by that was made by Keisuke Aizawa, I'm not sure I'm saying it right, from the Link Factory. It's a Japanese company that makes horror film um, props and special effects so that lady that looks like it's really horrible and disturbing to watch it's not a real person it's just a sculpture that a Japanese woman made for a horror film the sculpture was displayed at show at the Jen Vanilla Gallery a gallery in Tokyo Ginza district way back in August 2016 with her bird-like claws. Yes, it looks like she has like really ugly claws that looks like a bird. And she may be inspired by the Japanese bird woman. Okay, so this challenge, I have been seeing that on YouTube videos, they have them with a kid-friendly app. And the characters that are on the videos that this woman pops up, when the kids are watching are on the Peppa Pig or the Splatoon gameplay being edited with image of Momo, as I was saying, right? This now, Momo has like instructions for children to self-harm. Like I say, videos appear to be made by trolls with the express intention of trying to disturb children. And there will be children that might turn off the tablet or whatever they're watching, but there's another type of children who are more vulnerable to leave it on and watch it. So like I say, if you have kids, you are responsible of what your kids are watching. And you need to be aware of this new challenge. They are now like targeting really young children that watches Peppa Pig, mostly on the Peppa Pig videos. Um, if you wanna see what I'm talking about, just search on Google or YouTube or Facebook, Momo Challenge and she will pop up. And like I say, if you're a parent, please be aware of what your kids are watching always on the internet. 
Like for me, I'm always on point on what they're watching and giving them time limits and monitoring what they're seeing. So hopefully y'all get my advice and be aware, just be aware every time. It doesn't matter if there's not a new challenge, you need to always watch what your kids are watching on YouTube or doing on, on other type of apps like WhatsApp, who they're talking to, who they are watching, who they are chatting with. Like being a parent is rough and just give them a tablet and not seeing what they're watching, like that's not good neither. So hopefully y'all get my advice and this is not something like um, silly to laugh at like it's something serious there's been kids watching it like this woman it looks really creepy for me it looks really creepy that's why on the thumbnail she looks blurry so please watch what your kids are watching so see you on my next video bye everybody have a nice day